thought you were getting in there, right, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Got him. Holy cow! Oh. Wow! Woo. Come with that net, Joe. Oh, my gosh. Was that... Wow, man! Did you? Oh, the old man can still awesome. move, huh? Dude, you were moving, man! Holy cow! Yeah, he, she came on that hot. <laughs> Pop her loose here. That was awesome, dude. That's on the rainbow again. Wow! Yes. All right. In the water with you. It's a beautiful fish, isn't it, huh? Oh yeah. Open up. Hey folks, welcome to our musky segment. Chaz Martin with me. Dude, dude. dude. <laughs> You're awesome, man. I'll tell you, we've had a great day. Uh, we've had a five fish day already. It's just nuts. Well, yeah. we, we dialed in the pattern. We yes. called it right from the get-go this morning. In the garage. Yes, before we even launched the boat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and really it a lot of times we, we you know we're too you know we're, we're not fishing deep enough or we're not you know we're we're not in exactly the right terrain, but it, what we're finding out with these early season muskies a lot, folks, and we learn a lot of this as bass fishermen because yes. we see them. Yes. You're up there bass fishing, you see these muskies, and you go, gee, you know, the couple, first couple of muskie outings when we're out here, we're fishing early season muskies, and you got to get up in there. Absolutely, man. Yeah. Uh, you know, almost to the point where you most folks wouldn't think to fish that shell. No. I mean, we're talking one to three feet and more so the one to two feet on, you know. You know, and, and, and we're talking no break lines, no deep weed edges, none of that stuff, no edges of reefs. You're you're up in it. Yes. You're up in it. And that's the warmest water. Yeah. You know? And and, and you know, that's something you really gotta get into your head this time of the year, folks. And Chaz and I are fishing a variety of baits. Uh, you smoked one on a uh, on a slop master up in the reeds, and this fish I just caught was on the same color pattern in a five hundred. Booker tail over really on the edge of the reeds over some over well, some high something cabbage. Something you talk about a lot is complimenting. We're still we're both throwing shallow, but you're the lead caster and you're taking the line out in the open yes. uh, on the, those deeper weeds, and then Tyler and I are just bombing away in the shallow. Yeah, absolutely, super shallow, and, it, and it's working. Yes, it's absolutely working. Otherwise, you'd miss that fish. Otherwise, you'd miss that it. fish. What do you think about it for for <laughs> you were, you're pretty quick on your feet, man. Mid sixties, I can still. Yeah, I mean man. that was. I saw that fish coming. I went. Well, I guess I better just keep going. <laughs> I whipped him. I ran up, and you went. Yeah, that was unreal. Oh, folks, you're gonna love this. Uh, one of these, also one of these fish on these on the new downsizer musky rods from St. Croix. Watch the nine footer in action. Jack that fish and just keep going. <laughs> Holy cow! Oh, wow! Come with that net, Joe. Oh my gosh, was that? Not her, Joe. Oh, nice Daddy job. Plus move there, was wow, it? man. Did you? Oh, the old man can still awesome. move, huh? Dude, you were moving, man. 